Well, it's been a while since I've been up this end in the trim. It's only been a couple of days since I was up here in the van, opposite side of course. Just had four fantastic days away testing the van out. I've done some vlogging on it, so if you're interested, feel free to have a look. If you're not, just don't watch it, it's totally fine. I'm um, going to be posting it up anyway, kind of to do with the van stuff as well as just getting a good look around up Lomond area and things like that. And we've got up those sorts. This one handed stuff. Oh. She had every intention to come to knock me off, so I'm going to do the same. <laughs> <laughs> so if you're interested or you, you fancy going up Loch Lomond you want to know what it's like then it's definitely worth a look but today I'm in Scania the R450 68 plate and I'm driving my fridge for the first time in absolute weeks two, two weeks three weeks So it's uh, probably a one off this, like it's going to be a while when I'm chillacking accept any work from these again because I've got a lot going on. I'm doing container work Monday to Friday next week. So that'll be interesting anyway, but I'm, today's not too bad a one because I'm going into Bowness, which is nice, nice little run that. So 150, 155 mile from the yard. And then after I've done bonus and the Livy, new system getting through the gates and that, so I'll fire it up onto the on the camera and we'll try and work it out. I've never used it before. So I, that might help people who have got to go into Tesco's Livingston in Scotland. It might be in all of the places now, I don't know, but if you're coming into Livy, this is the way you book in now as well. It's just the bottom of this hill and it's a right turn when you get to the bottom. Just quite like slowly slowly round here, it's a small village. See how quite tight the roads are so if you had another truck coming up it'd be a little bit awkward. But with manage. That view though, beautiful. Driver kind enough just to get out of my way there, coming down with the momentum. It's a little sneaky right here. Sure, it's flying around the corner. Give yourself plenty of turning. When you come here, when it's busy, like with staff changeover, this road is really, really busy with cars, double parked, and whatnot. Sometimes you can have a bit of a job getting through. his first left here. And normally stuff I spot on. You can see now already there's one on the bay there, turners. Uh, 
Vaan. Just stop there a second. Bit of a tighty. Do you have to go and make that on there, I'll you. There you are, mate. It's a bit tight if you go all the way back. Oh, okay. Right, you need to phone up with, to get into Tesco's with this delivery. They like you to ring up. The driver rings up before they go in. Anyway, and it's not booked in till 5.30 p.m. And I'm going to get there. Traffic permit, 5.30 p.m. So he was a happy buddy. Ideal. So I've got a reference number and then we're going to run into Tesco's. I'll stick the camera on the side window and that should do the job. We'll have a little look at what we've got to do to get in there now. It's all different. took five minutes to get the stuff off and they let us sit there for 15 so I've got a 15 in there there's nothing else coming in he said so yeah yeah happy just take your break got another bee anyway but now it's coming in and then all I need to do is squeeze a 30 once you get tipped at Tesco
sun's come out. You know. Yes. Tipped. Okay, here we go. Guy next was there struggling. English. Confirm. Confirm. I have. I understand. I understand. I confirm, confirm. I have one, confirm. Put the number in five zero nine. Gonna be good in the winter time, pulling down my rain or snow. Confirm. Confirm, confirm, I'll say 5090374838, confirm, Subscriber you dialed is busy now. Please dial later. The subscriber you dialed is busy now. Please dial later. The subscriber you dialed is busy now. Please dial later. The subscriber you dialed is busy now. Please dial later. Hi mate, I'm at the gate. I've been here five minutes trying to get in. It's telling us to contact them and there's nobody answering. It's saying there's no ASN for this load. Please press intercom, leave a site and request an ASN to be sent from your office. Represent once the ASN has been sent. Yeah, that's not one of the first 
welcome. Not any um, LM505 number. Two seconds. Maybe in the envelope. I've got LM, yeah? Right, well that's in. It's not even on the system. Just managed to speak to somebody there, but... Hey, look. Honestly. Not even on the system. The Helsing Road, would you bring Helsing? Aye. And that's the number they gave us. Will do. Will that bring Helsing? No, uh, I'm just talking my ship, so I'm kind of locked out of everything, so if you need to be patient. So, where are you and what problem is everything, so if you need to be patient. Right, I'm at uh, Livingston, Tesco's. Yes. And I phoned up Puff and I were going, I got an LC number off you, but it's not been accepted. And I give them the the other number inside the paperwork, and they said it's not on their system either. All right. Well, day thirty six. <laughs> Told by a human. Hi mate, you didn't give us a code to get out buddy. Hi, are you going out? Going out. What's the name of your company? Yes, mate, I've just come off okay, bay 36. Door is open. Right, well, I know it's working for some, but didn't for me there, like. So it didn't work going in, didn't work coming out. So, I disapprove so far. I'm sure everyone else using it will have no problems. But I'm here, I'm vlogging it, and it's give us crap going in, crap going out. And everyone will go, oh, it's fine man, just, you know, now and then, get your the blip. Fine, but I'm vlogging it. And the blip was open, going in, blip coming out. Shite. <laughs> 